My name is Colleen Dwyer and I came to Penn Medicine for treatment for an acoustic neuroma. I work in a school setting and then I started noticing that I really wasn't hearing things and then I got concerned. My family physician called me and said to come right in and he, but he started the conversation out and said, yes, you're here because I'm, I want to tell you that you have a brain tumor. At the time I was 51, that really scared me. I would like to continue to work for a while. You know, I have yet to have grandchildren. I have a lot of things going on in my life and I did not want to hear that this tumor was going to be life-changing. Then I realized, and I have said over and over, that the, the most stressful thing not even being told that I had a brain tumor was deciding where I would get treatment. I had started really searching around and then uh, I asked uh, my cousin's uh, physician and just said, who would you go to at Penn? He actually had said, sent me an email and said, that's a no-brainer, it would be Dr. Lee that you would speak to. You know, I've had other surgeries in the past and when you know you're in the right hands, you're, I a lot of my fear at least is eliminated. Dr. Lee's attitude right from the get-go, he never, he never had a negative thing to say about it and you know he assured me that with my attitude and his guidance we were going to get through this and I would be as good as new. I knew that at Penn Medicine I was in the best hands so this surgery day I wasn't nervous or anything it was almost probably how my husband feels when he's going to run a marathon, just let's get this over with. <laughs> I knew the first day was going to be awful because this affects your balance nerve and your balance nerve is cut, so you have that dizziness, etc. But I knew it was nothing I couldn't get through if it was only going to you know, be for a certain period of days, it wasn't going to be all the time. My husband and I uh, had said right away and we did a survey that it was the best care that anyone could imagine that I received at Penn. Every person just seemed to have so much confidence and you know, was so positive with everything that they said and how they cared for me. Right down to the physical therapists, which are such a big part of your recovery. They have to get you up and get you on your feet and able to walk so you can get out the door. And of course, when they come in that first day and the room's spinning and you feel pretty lousy, and they're just so upbeat and caring that, uh, it, you know, it, it never worried me. And it really never, you know, I just knew that every part of it was a, a part of the process to, for my recovery. And I look back on this a year ago and, you know, January 2nd is when I was told I had it. And, you know, whenever I walk in here, especially in January, I think, where was I a year ago? I was, a year ago, I was petrified and now I'm just as good as new and life goes on and it's all thanks to Dr. Lee.